Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Activities for People Living with Dementia. We're proud to offer this series with funding from the Area Agency on Aging and the United Way of Tarrant County. Some of our programs are recorded and some are made available for viewing through a YouTube channel for future use. Find us on YouTube by typing in Dementia Friendly Fort Worth, click on our logo and choose videos. I am Martha Brown, your host for today's activities. It is always all of our pleasure to bring back Emily Corbin. And today she's bringing Fitwits to us to pump some neurons in our brain. Emily, I'm ready for some mental gymnastics today. Take it away. All right, Martha, thank you. Hello to all, it's a good group. It is. Oh, hello. Today. All right, are we ready to put our thinking caps on? Mm -hmm. Got them on. Right. It's invisible. That's right. <laughs> no, I'm yeah. resisting it. It's invisible. I like it. <laughs> So you can really wear any kind of hat you want. With uh, yeah. I really like your hat. I just did my Martha. hair though, so I'm kind well, of, thank you. Know, I can't commit. I'm having a hard time committing to the hat. <laughs> there you go. There you go. And it's hard to, it's hard to see. <laughs> All right. How about, are we good? Is this good? You're good, yeah. You can't see like that, guys. You're looking pretty cool, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that. All right. So let me share my screen with you. Please. Please, yes. I will. I'm going to do it. Uh, there we go. I like your pink coordination today, Emily. Ah, thank you. Thank you for noticing. Did you plan that? <laughs> All right. I shouldn't ask. <laughs> well, I don't know about plan or it's just how I operate. Mm -hmm. I, I have a bunch of hats kind of sitting there and I just kind of go for the one that fits the fits the vibe you know yeah gotcha. <laughs> so that's uh how we ended up with the one today yes wearing a gray hat but today we had to go in <coughs> pink so and also there's a reason I chose uh this particular type of hat um, so are you all seeing my screen now? I see a baseball player. Ah, yes. So you're already getting clues about today's theme. Yes. <laughs> oh no, go back. There we go. How's my internet connection? A minute ago, it was a little bit unstable. So it's, if it's I have a now. delay in hearing okay. you answer. It's okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right, good. Let's go. It was here. unstable for a bit, but it's better now. It seems better. Okay, good deal. So today is October 6, 2022. Yes. Of 62. We're feeling that uh, cool weather. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anybody have a birthday this month? Nope. No one here? No, no October birthdays. All right. Okay, then. So we usually with our FitWits program start with a little on this day in history. And we're just going to let this particular topic kind of take us away today. Uh, so on this day in history in 1882, the first game in the world, the first game in the first World Series of baseball was played. Um, does anyone know what city that was in? 1882. Sorry, Jim Abel, and I don't see you on my Instagram. Uh-oh, Jim? Hang on I don't see Jim, do you need to tap on your screen? So you can see. Jim, is that any better? No, it's not you. I, guess. I think it's me. Oh, now your face went away, Jim. Yeah. But do you still hear our voices? 
Uh oh. Hmm. That might be a no. That may be Jim's the most unstable of all of us. Well, in a, in a technical Jim kind of way, yeah. Exactly. Yes, in a technical right. kind of way. Right. I hope Jim will be able to come back yeah. with us. But until then, does anyone know what city, without peeking, <laughs> I'll just guess John's Baltimore. typing away. What city? I, I, the... <laughs> what did I you guess, say, Nancy? What city? I was guessing Baltimore. I'd say Philadelphia. And I guess okay. Cincinnati. And I guess Chicago. <laughs> what did you guess, uh, Yetta? Cincinnati. You got it. Cincinnati. Oh, oh right. yay, yeah, Yetta. That was the invisible cat. <laughs> <laughs> It's I working. Mean, I've got to get one of those. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Got to get an amazing. invisible cap. Four different right. guesses. <laughs> right? Sorry. And you were all, you know, you were all in the correct area of the country, right? Yep. Um, of course, that's where most of the action in the country was at that time, as far as this kind of thing. But 1882. So what were the teams? If it was in Cincinnati, I don't oh, know what were those teams. What the team is called the Reds. The Reds. Okay. Was, was the Reds one of them? Maybe, sort of. Okay. Red Sox. Red Sox. Okay. <laughs> Probably not, Martha. Um, oh well. <laughs> well. I don't know. Um, so back then, things were so different, right? Oh yeah. We yeah. <laughs> we used uh, a different word for stock, right? Oh. What what was the word that we Stockings. might have used? Stockings. Yep. yep. So can you believe that the Cincinnati oh. Red Stockings beat? White stockings. White <laughs> stockings. <laughs> yeah, see, no, I got to see. me up when I saw that. Can you believe it? Yeah. No. Uh, real. Probably is that that true? true? Yeah, that's true. Red yes. oh, red you don't believe it, Myra? <laughs> no, I believe it. I just have never seen it before. Well, it's funny because the White Sox are, are, are actually a team in Chicago still. White Sox. Yeah. Are, and yeah. the Red Sox. Stockings turned into the reds. So that's kind of interesting. So at some point, right, these not only did our link, but you know, the names of the teams evolved for different reasons. And um I I had hoped that Phil would be here today so that he could get excited about the Chicago White Stockings. I thought if there was one person in our group right. who might know that, it might be Phil. Because mm -hmm. um, just being such a lover of Chicago, you know, yeah. true, true blue Chicago guy. Mm -hmm. But um, what a fun, uh, can you imagine their logos, right? <laughs> uh, I mean, nowadays, let's, let's find a picture of a white stocking, shall we? Yeah. What? Hippie long stockings is all that comes to mind. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was a great book. <laughs> You know, I'm still trying to picture what they were wearing. <laughs> like, they were wearing red red stockings coats and white with, stockings. Uh, long, with kind of long coats with, with uh, kind of pants that had stockings that they wore, wore boots in, or I don't know. I'm just trying to... Like, like Santa Claus? Don't, don't forget, they, they must have worn these knickers, or what do you call them? Those Nicker, the yeah. yeah. I bet they and then did. they had red socks or white socks on. Yeah. Wow. I wonder if um probably not a Christmas sock. <laughs> <laughs> probably not, but it's the one that came up. So plus this one is both red and white. They could have shared a logo, right? Yeah, it, yes. This yeah. is the white stock. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> probably not a Christmas stocking. You're right, you gotta. Um so that brings me to let's talk about some baseball vocabulary just some of the words that you think of when you think about baseball um so anything just flies. You can call something out flies 
Flies. Flies. Flies and uh, fly balls. Fly balls. Flies. Yeah. F L I E S. Flies. Um, and uh, uh, home runs. Home run. Home runs. Stealing. Take me, out, take me out to the ball game. The oh, that's right. Batter okay. up. That's a that's Ooh. a that's a that's a uh, like the the song that's been that, that plays with the White Sox games for I don't know since I was in the, oh, really? there, since the sixties. Yeah, uh, Harry, Harry Carey. Harry Carey. Harry Carey was the uh, announcer. Yeah. Grounded. I think they, I think they per buried him there somewhere. I'm not sure. Yeah. Home runs. Just jump in and say something. Okay. What I'm supposed to do. How about? Yeah, Jim says who's on first. With... Who's on first? Who's on first? That's right, excellent. Jim. Excellent. Good. Yeah. Go, Jim. Oh. What do you think about with baseball? I wonder if we could find baseball cap a, a video of that. Probably. Hey, Please. Patricia. Good morning. Baseball cap. Baseball, baseball cap. And a strike. I thought you said cat, Myra. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Cap, cap, uh, baseball cap. cap. Uh, and I wrote cap. You think of one? Even though I knew <laughs> she said cap. Okay. Uh, Martha said fly ball. Mm. Yes. Uh, what would I'm I'm missing some for sure. Take me out to the ball game. Grounder. A steal. A Grounder. Steal. Ooh. Steal. Dugout. Interesting. Bidding. Dugout. Right. Uh, what are they called? <laughs> Referee, refs, the referee. Oh, ref. Am oh, I, yeah. uh, is, and cursing. <laughs> is it a referee? Oh, yeah. Or are they, um, they're umpires, aren't they? Umpires. Okay. Oh, even better. Yeah, huh. that's better. Um, a pitcher. Pitcher, catcher. Pitcher and a catcher, yeah. Okay, so you guys are into the player. Yeah. Center field. Is my connection <sighs> stable again? Yeah. A little bit, but you're, you're still okay. Yeah. We hear you more than we don't hear you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> we'll take it. Yeah. Jim said first base, I think. Didn't you, Jim? Yes. Okay. Nice. What about... Um, a pennant, what? baseball pennant. Ooh, oh, those were important pennant? when you were a teenager. <laughs> yeah. And and you just said it too, Myra, a baseball. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That might be the most important part. Baseball and a bat. And a bat, yes. Another very important part. What about a myth? How about one of those spitting? Central items. Oh, spitting. <laughs> <laughs> spitting. <laughs> I love it. Okay. It's the other spin. rude gestures. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to leave curse words out of it. Permits? I'm not a great speller, you guys. I'm That's realizing it. Uh -huh. that I'm not a great speller. Spitting. Mit? Oh. What, is that? what are you spelling? Mit. M I T. Spitting. MIT? A oh, mit. Yeah, uh, a mit. Yeah. That's a, that's with, a time. Ball, 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 ball. If we're Catcher. looking for positions um, on the team, there is shortstop. Feel. That's right. Shortstop. Short that's stop. what my dad played. All right. Okay, Pat, uh, what did you say? Outfield. Outfield, yeah. Outfield. That's where they always okay. put Lucy. <laughs> I don't That's right. That. I guess I only I only see like a, a few people. So <laughs> hi Pat. <laughs> hi. In hi. Okay. Don't forget don't forget the hot dog. Oh, hot dog. That's right. <laughs> What's going next, Pat? Thank you. 
I'm super excited for us to, to do all the food. <laughs> Let's get to the, the good part. Like, why right. I go to baseball games? Beer. <laughs> beer, yeah. Popcorn. My <laughs> Hot dogs. I said, why are you going to baseball games? Okay. She said, beer. Beer. All right. Beer. Yeah. Pretzels. Pretzels. Popcorn. Pretzels. Popcorn. Cracker, you hear the what are they those cracker pickles, what are they called? Cracker Jack. Cracker Jack. Cracker Jack. Peanuts. Peanuts. Somebody said peanuts. Was oh, that peanuts? Linda? Yeah. Thank peanuts. you, Linda. That's a big one. We got to Don't forget that. the Cokes. Oh, yeah. That's true. Um, oh, those little hats that they turn upside down box. and put stuff in. Hmm. Those, like nachos? Oh, no, like the, no, but the, they're like ice cream. They're they're dipping dots. Yes. That? No, but that, okay. There's I'm missing two things. No. That feels too modern. Is that too modern to me? Yeah, that's too modern. My granddaughter would like dipping dots. <laughs> we don't want that. Okay, but somebody said somebody said I think was had I'm a couple behind you guys okay. so okay it was around when we said Cracker Jacks it was after that uh, Coke peanut. someone said peanut and Coke thank you oh wow seven up yeah. that feels like that's enough yeah yeah I'm full <laughs> Are you full? <laughs> hey, I, I got one more word. I, I got I one more it. word. Not food. Okay. This is not food, but it's a. Uh, oh, you already got it. dugout. Okay, never mind. I thought I didn't know you had dugout. Right, never, never mind. Okay. Tums. Tums. And you know Tums. <laughs> Tums. <laughs> That's too modern. Pepto. All right. If I ate all of that, I'd need those. Get it? Did we bleachers? Wait, oh, good one. Oh, Bleachers. great, Kat. Bismo, B-I-S-S-M-O. One S. One S, okay. My grandmother called that pepto business. Yes. <laughs> she had business. Business. <laughs> All right, time for some baseball humor. Does anybody have a baseball joke, I wonder? Mm -hmm. Oh, who's on first? Mm. Uh, that'll, that'll I, I wonder if we could find it. I'm going to see. Cool. I'm going to see if we can. I do have a couple jokes for us, though. Ah. There it is. Yay. Eight minutes long. We probably won't get through eight minutes of it, but we can a couple minutes. I'm not sure if the sound is going to share, so you'll have to let me know. Mm. Nope. My connection says nope. So we can all look that up on our own later. On yes. After we My go to video. My connection is, is not going to, but that's fun. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Let me take that away. Nope. And of course, I, I got a started. joke. Oh no, don't look, don't look, don't look. Not looking. Because I took a couple from that site. What's that done? I, I have a joke. Okay. Oh, why does, why does the pitcher ra raise one leg when he throws the ball? Say that again, please. <laughs> why does the pitcher raise one leg when he throws the ball? If he raised two, he'd fall down. That's it. That's it. it. <laughs> oh, it's not. It is. That's it. it yeah. is. That is it. Don, you must have found the same site that I found. I wonder. Probably. Oh, no. That's the very first joke. If you did, then you can't give away the answers on these, okay? Oh, uh, are you on Scary Mommy? Because that's a really funny Yeah, Scary Mommy. That yeah, like that's it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> he closed it down. I told him. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Where do they keep the largest diamond in New York City? Yankee yeah. Stadium. Yeah. You got it. All right. Woo. 
Oh, I like oh, that. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That lovely noise. Was that you, Martha? No, it wasn't me. I thought you did it, Emily. What? Really? I did no. not. Uh-uh. <laughs> I, I was busy making three left turns. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, if you were uh, leaving home, making three left turns, and were then on your way back and masks waiting for you, who would they be? The umpires? The umpire and the catcher. Yeah. I believe oh. so. Oh, how cool is that? You got it. <laughs> you got it, Baseball yeah. Baseball riddles. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. What did the baseball glove say to the ball? Ouch. <laughs> That's good, Myra. That is good. Catch you later. <gasps> yes. Welcome home. Catch you. Excuse me. Welcome home. I like you got that. it. Catch you later. Look. Catch you later. <laughs> I got one. Catch I got one. Later. Okay. Okay. okay what ahead. is it? Why did? Why did the Braves hire a baker? Hmm. The Braves hire a baker. <clears throat> I don't know. Did they give up? Y'all give up? Did yes. they raise? Because I they know needed this one, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna cheat and give it away. Go ahead, Pat. Because they needed a new batter. A new batter. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> I mean, Dusty would have liked that. There's one. no limit to the baseball pun. Yeah, but what, right? what did the baseball club say to the ball? We haven't heard. Catch you oh, later. Catch you later. Catch you later. Catch you later. Oh, catch you later. I, okay. Catch you later. Yep. So, uh, What's the, the difference for, logic, for a logic puzzle? Okay. Oh, yeah. I had it. one more. Okay. Go for it. What's the difference between a pickpocket and an umpire? Hmm. Uh -oh. A, a, a pickpocket always steals <laughs> steals a wallet, but the mm -hmm. umpire never doesn't always get the the steal. Does always get the steal correct? On I don't know something like that. Something about stealing. It's almost there. It's one steals watches and the other one watches steals. Oh, that's <laughs> good. <laughs> good, Pat. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But Don, you were you were on the right. What's that? I'm sorry. Pat, you. Anybody up for? Oh, asking, I, I said you were on the right track. You were, okay. you were doing yeah. great. Thank you. <laughs> Emily, I'm you're coming out. I'm about shifting us over. Okay. Run. So hang on a sec, okay? Okay. It what? I don't know. I ain't gonna say. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. Hey, while Emily's doing that, um, oh, yeah. I don't know if you guys can see. I've got a picture of the the red stockings from uh, from uh, 19, 1869. Wow. <laughs> I'm trying to get it close enough. There you go. There you go. Oh my good. They were wearing <laughs> bloomers, weren't they? And they have, they have leather shoes on. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow, Don. That's super cool. Uh-huh. 1869. Those red stockings. Oh my goodness. <laughs>
And it looks like the, hey guys, the, the, the curse of your beard and everybody else have mustaches. Yes. Okay. Say that again, Don, please. Looks like the coach had a beard and everybody else had mustaches. Ooh. Mustaches were in. I guess, yeah. 130 years ago. Yeah. 140 years ago. Ooh. Yeah, 150 years ago, isn't it? Oh. No, it's not. You're, you're, you're right. It's 100, 100, uh, exactly 150, right? It's no, it's, it's, a, it's 70 plus 20. That's 90 something. Yeah, 90 something, 99. That's amazing. Okay, where do catchers sit at lunch? Where do catchers sit at lunch? In front of the plate. Huh? <laughs> What'd you say? I bet so that's in, right. In, in front of the plate. No, behind the plate. Behind the plate. Oh. <laughs> okay, you're right. Behind is correct, yes. Yes. <laughs> Emily, you're working hard, aren't you? No, uh, we okay. lost you. We lost you, Emily. Oh, there she is again. There she is. is. I can't get it today. Emily, you're working so hard. We appreciate you. <laughs> Thank you, Martha. You're so well, welcome. I am the money for hoping that our connection is going to be better. <laughs> is it better? Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh, much yes, better. Yes. Okay. And hopefully you don't hear too much of that outside noise right now. Don't no. hear a bit of it. Don't hear a bit of it. Great. Perfect. You don't hear my outside noise either, do you? Nope. Mm -hmm. I don't. There you go. <laughs> there, there's something with concrete happening. I don't know. There's always something happening out there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Da, da, da. This is, you know what? I'm going to change the subject. This is really sad about this man going in this daycare killing all these kids for no reason. Oh, yeah. Over in Thailand. Yeah. That is sad. It is. He just walked up in there and just started stabbing the kids. Yep. And then they always end up killing themselves in the end. And, yes. All right, that's so sad. Exactly, Yetta. Well, the, uh, Patricia, I guess that's for another day, huh? Yeah. I guess so, but I, I let's, let's just say it. Yes, it is. <laughs> are you all are you all seeing this now? I'm sorry about yes. the delay. I see a logic puzzle. Logic puzzle. A logic puzzle. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. oh no, logic. So yeah, working with our baseball theme and if we need to take a break or if we decide we don't have enough time to finish, that's no problem. <laughs> we, will, we will go back to humor if we need to. <laughs> um, but this is gonna help us get that last little bit of you know, exercise uh, for our brains. All right. So uh, we're gonna work with uh, the Porterville High School varsity baseball team. So they just finished their best season yet, and we are supposed to match each player to his position and determine how many games they played this season. So we're going to read through the clues, and each time we feel like we've learned something, we're going to go and check one of the boxes uh, next to what we've learned, see how far we get. All right. Excellent. So if we start with number one, Evan played nine games. So you'd mark then a, a, we can put a check mark, right? By Evan. Yes, and absolutely. Number right. Evan and nine. nine. Great. Let's do it. Yay, Evan. <clears throat> and then we get to eliminate all of those other ones right there. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So then with number two, what do we learn there? That Vincent played first base. That's right. Okay. Vincent. Vincent, first base, green yep. dot. Yep. Mm -hmm. right. Excellent. Look, look how much progress we've made. Ooh, right. You got good. two right. <laughs> <laughs> so far, so good. Uh, the player who played third base played two more games than the player who played center field. Ah, here's one of those. All right, so it can't be player number 
10. It can't be, it can't be, uh, it, it's got to be either eight or nine in order to get, say, so that, so they have at least two games, they can play two games more than the other player. So eight and nine right. are the only numbers that they can pick. Uh, 10 and 11 is, is are out. So third base, um, well, third base would have to be would have to be ten or eleven, and couldn't be eight or nine. Is that is that no, correct, no. John? No, you said two two more games. So so or, so if if if, if uh, the the uh, the play the per person played center field one uh, played in eight games, then that the person that played uh, in third three. base is. Uh, has won ten games, or if one not for one. It's either see, the answer is either ten or eleven. I meant to say, but I said it better. The answer is either ten or eleven. Yeah. Okay. So then, as far as third base goes, we oh. know we can eliminate eight and nine. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Okay. Yep. So let's look for there's third base. I'm gonna eliminate eight and nine. Okay. And then I think we can eliminate something for center field also. Yeah. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Well, maybe. So if oh, we yeah, know... right. so yeah, you're right. The, the the person that played in center mm -hmm. field has to well has well, to want uh, one. Charles played two more games than the player who played center field. Right. I'm sorry. Right. The third base plays two. So. Okay, so go ahead, go ahead, Emily. I'm just I'm just talking out so loud. Let's let's just stick with number three okay. and what we learned from number three. The player who played third base played two more than the one who played center. So we know right. that third base can't be eight or nine because it has to be two more than something, right? right. And mm -hmm. then but what we also learn is that center field has to be two less than something, right? right. And so right. it can't be 10 or 11. It can be. It has uh, to be eight or nine. Is that right? Yes. Does, uh, does that sound that, that okay, right. everybody? Yeah. yeah. Uh -oh. That's All right. Lost me in your thinking there. Well, you know, Yetta, sometimes I lose myself in my, in my <laughs> thinking. So. But, but uh, yeah, the logic was good. If the player who played center field was two games behind the player who played third base. That means the player that went center field. That's not what I meant to do. Has to uh, be either eight or nine games. I'm trying to undo this here. Well, this is the right answer. No, it'll turn green even if it's the wrong answer. If you oh, okay, it okay. Twice. Yeah. So, okay. So center field cannot be 10 or 11. That's correct. All right. Yeah. We got to stick with it because even though we can get, uh, I, I especially get really um, like what's going on and then I get overwhelmed and I just want to walk away from it. I have to take a deep breath and move to the next clue, right? So number four, Charles oh. played two more than the player who played center field. So did, did Charles and play third base? <coughs> I don't know. Because the player I... who played third base played two more games than the person who played center field. And Charles played two more games than the player who played center field. It sounds about right to me. Charles could be either, okay. <coughs> Sorry. Bless you. That that sounds like good logic to me. Yet, the sound has to be person... it has to be either ten or eleven, right? <laughs> I don't know, but the player who played first Bless base, you. Don, he played two more games than the player that played center field. Right. Played oh, I see what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah. I see. That's, I think I see what you're talking about. Yeah. So, so tell me, tell me what we just figured out. <laughs> I think that Charles played third base. You think Charles played third base? Okay. Mm -hmm. 
And we think he played third base because only one person could have played exactly two more than the person at center field. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So Charles, third base. Let's check it off. Oh, nope, not that. Nope, not that. I don't know if we can do that. Oh. Does that does that sound right? Mm hmm Okay. Or does it look right? Charles was either. No, because now oh, Charles we can't do it, in. can we? <laughs> Nine hmm. games or ten games. So Charles so did not game. play center field, so... That, that Charles cannot play center field. You put if, if you put an X there, that would be good. That's yeah, that's absolutely true. Well, actually, he can play ten. He can play eleven games. He could have played games. third base and played okay. ten or eleven games. I don't think we. I don't think we did anything incorrect by selecting third base there. Now. What we did was figure out part of it, and the next part is to figure out whether he played nine or ten. Because if we look right. over at third base, if you look at the far right, top far right in that mm -hmm. third base column where we have an X at eight and nine, um, it's we know that the person who played third base couldn't have played eight or nine games, right? Mm -hmm. And that lines up with Charles. It, it doesn't conflict with Charles having played third base, right? And right. now if we go to number five and it tells us that Charles was either the one who played nine or the one who played 10 games, we know that if we take together the fact that he played third base mm -hmm. and the fact that third base couldn't have played nine games, so we might have to assume games. that he played 10. That's right. And you know what? We could be wrong and go back and fix it. But does it sound like good logic? Does it? Anybody yeah. see any holes in that logic? No, I, I don't no. see any holes in that logic. Okay. Well, let's let's go with it, okay. shall we? All right. Ah, so now we've been through all of the clues and we have to go back through them again and see what we discover this second time around. Probably not gonna learn a whole lot more from number one besides Evan played nine games, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Number two, Vincent played first base. Okay. Right. Wait, Vincent played first base? Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah. Do I have it okay, in right. the wrong one? No, 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 you're right. You're right. So Evan okay. and Carl could could be uh, um, either uh, center field or shortstop, one or the other. It's got to be one or the other. You said Evan and Carl would have to be center or, or second. Yes. Short. Okay. Shortstop okay. or. Shortstop. Or, or or center shortstop or second or sh shortstop or center yes short because, or center. because there, there's two squares in each of those lines and one one could be one one could be the other but they can't be both that's right the same color. yep that is that is right so how are we going to figure that out uh, what do we we need to learn more about Evan and Carl but how do we learn more about Evan and Carl um, when we don't see their names, right? Well, um, we, okay. well, we know that Evan played nine games. Right. Charles was either the boy, I mean, we are back down there, that played nine games, but he can't, he can't do that since Evan did it. Um, both have yeah, he's already, there's already X, there's already X there. Oh, really? Yeah, Evan played is that nine. Wrong, is that a wrong answer then? Evan played nine games, so Charles has to play the 10 games. Okay. In my mind, but I don't know. That's not bad logic. You've got your invisible cap on it. Sounds good to me. <laughs> it's it's correct. It's it's a mark that we 
We learned that one from number five, but we hadn't filled in the box yet. Okay. So yeah, that's definitely, that's definitely correct. Okay. Right. See, making progress. Yeah. Yeah, we're doing quite well. Um, oh, oh, so, oh, okay. Never mind. So, yeah. So now we need to learn more about Carl and Vincent, seems like. A um, little, bit, little bit about Evan as well. Okay. So the player who played third played two more than the play person who played center. Let's look at who played center. That was, that was uh, Charles. That was Evan, Evan or uh, Carl. No, Charles. Yeah, Charles. Charles. Charles is marked for third base already. Yeah. So Evan or Carl is oh, Evan Carl. Okay. Um, this one's tricky, guys. Evan or Carl played center or first. Yeah, I don't know whom of them. Evan and Evan and Carl. They they played either center or first. Well, right. Vincent played first. Oh, shortstop. Shortstop and... Yeah. Oh, yes. Center Short. shortstop. Yeah. So, okay. We, we well, gotta, actually, so, I think we're going... We might need to slow down. Well, I have one more observation. Oh, yes, please. Okay, so Evan won nine games, right? Mm hmm So he cannot be third base because that's, that's uh, a next... On 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 uh, on that uh, on the bottom, right. He also couldn't be shorts. No, no. Go ahead. You're right. Um, could he be shortstop? Um, I don't know. I'm sorry, I interrupted you. I I, I don't know. I was, my I, my my logic was falling apart at that point. <laughs> I get it. I totally get that. Um, can we do a joke? Let's do a joke. <laughs> I, I got a joke, but it's not a baseball joke. And the center field. Okay, I'm going to leave it up and I'll find us a joke on my other screen. How about that? Don's got a joke for you. Oh, please. It's, it's not exactly a baseball joke, but it's, a, it's one of No uh, problem. Um, so, five ants moved into a building and rented, rented a room there. Um, later on, five more ants moved into the building. Uh, and rent a room. So, what can you? What, what are those five ants called? You right? You right? You want me to say? They're actually. No, no. Would you call them renters? No, nope, that's not the right answer. Okay. Kind I'm, of right. I'm sorry. My my sound went all catty wampus. Okay. Would you ask the question again? A five ants sure. moved into a building. Right. And then five more. So what do you call the ants that live in the building? Tenants. 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 That's right. Tenants. 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 <laughs> that was awesome. I love these. Oh, that's good. Tenants. Oh. Kills me. Um, do you have another one, Don? Oh, um, I got. Well, I got one. Jokes on okay. demand are hard. <laughs> let me let me think about this through. Well, actually, it's a uh, it, uh, Martha. What would you call the uh, Vix Forty Four? Uh, is that a joke or is it... you've told that one? Uh, not to pun. these guys. Not to these guys. It's a pun. It's a pun. Oh, actually, yeah. So I'm going to tell you a, a, a pun. Okay, so there's a truck driving down the road, and it has an accident, and, and it falls over, and all its cargo goes out on the, on, the, on the freeway. Luckily, the truck was carrying VIX 44, so there was no congestion. <laughs> yeah, I have heard that one, but it still cracks me up. <laughs> and that there concludes no the Don Gasser portion of this show. <laughs> Try the Salisbury steak. Ah. <laughs> right. Uh, uh, 
uh, all you can eat buffet. That's right. All That's right. right. <laughs> so do we feel like we could jump back in? I, I do yes. have to uh, I do have to go over to the other uh, yeah. place in just a minute, but we could we could just take another pass. Oh, yes, we do. <laughs> you have yeah, I know. We need, we, we need to figure this one out, Emily. Before these we are so fun, I, I would like to as well. So, um, let's give it a shot. Player who played third base played two more than the person on center field. We have third base figured out. Mm -hmm. Number four, Charles played two more than center field. We center know Charles was the one at third. Mm -hmm. So center field was eight. Your, your thing is on because the bottom. We get we can't see the bottom, Emily. Oh, there thank you. you. Sorry. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank. Yeah. So Martha, yes, that was an important insight that that if Charles played ten then center field would have to have been eight. Yes. Right. That's that's important. Okay. So let's take uh, center field and click our eight. And then what does that leave available for? Don't well, we, Don't stop. we yeah. know that Evan can't have been center field then. Right? That's right, because oh. Evan is nine. If we look mm -hmm. at, at, at uh, hint number four, Charles played uh -huh. two more games than the player who played center field. So center field would be eight. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so center field would be eight, but that also tells us that Evan can't be center field because exactly. Evan so played nine. Yeah. And and so that eliminates everything except for shortstop for Evan. That's right. That's yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good. Yes, you guys and then, look. And then center field has to be Carl. Or has to be mm -hmm. Carl. Yeah. Oh, please. So fill it in. <laughs> so what does that tell us about um Carl has to be eight or eleven? Well, Carl said center field. So he has to be eight. Eight. Carl has to be eight because of hint number four. Oh. And Vincent oh, just, has to be. No, but you, you put Carl, it's you X oh, Carl at eight. My bad. Yep. There we go. Yay, we did it. All right. Well, we have, we have to figure out the base, base part of it. Oh, well, that's uh -oh. okay. Where'd you guys go? No. What's the best part? Well, you, there was a couple scores left, but that's okay. We got most of it. Well, I don't think it. Did you see the um, the big purple right over here? Congratulations! Um, right, you saw but it didn't fill on the, on the the thing didn't fill up. It the, on it the, doesn't let you once you get to a place where oh. um it it's, it just goes without saying it okay. um it just pops up the congratulations and right. and, and you're done. done. All right. You are. Put and then you only can go yeah. to eleven thirty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna stop sharing my screen. That was super fun, guys. Uh, Thank okay, you, Emily. Emily. Have a good and day. You all, you all get gold stars and and World Cup pennants today. All right, Yay. World Cup, World Cup, soccer. Pin one on the wall of my bedroom. Yeah, yeah. a pennant. <laughs> World Cup pennants. Yeah, clearly yeah. I'm not a bowler, Don. I mean, <laughs> that's, <right. laughs> that's so funny, Emily. We you know guys? you have to scoot to 11:30. Yeah, and thank yeah. you very thank much. You, Emily. Okay, you're welcome. Very much. Bye -bye. Yes. Well, does anybody have anything to share before we sign off for the day? What's the, What's tomorrow? Oh, that's a good question. Let oh, I know. Ooh, 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 oh, you know? Is, oh, is it? Yeah. It's what? The dog. The pets. The pet. Oh, pets are practical oh, with pets. Pets are practical. Yeah. Okay. And that will be at all three presentations tomorrow. Don, thank you for asking.